hello and welcome back to my youtube channel it's dawn here how are we all doing today i do hope you are all well so today what we are going to be doing is making a nice quick easy card today just using the victorian treasures paper pack um the pink dress and some of my handwritten word sentiments um so yeah um these ones are in the uh pink holog holographic which i just thought were gorgeous but i thought we, yeah let's make just a, a super super simple card using one of the dresses so what i'm gonna do um is i want to grab some ink out i'm gonna grab my vintage of photo and i'm also gonna grab my dobbers as well so let me just grab them um and i'm going to use two of the papers um where's the brown one so i've already used quite a few of my papers so that's all i have left um uh, so the, the paper packs you do get three of each um in each design so what i want to do is i want to cut these down um so we do need my trimmer let's grab that and what i'm going to do because i'm doing a five by seven card i just want to put this down to i'm going to cut it down to um four and three quarters and then i'm going to cut two one and a quarter strips one for the top and one for the bottom so as not to waste my paper okay uh where's my peel offs because i think I want my peel offs. The other thing, actually, I might do. I'm going to bring in some gold card as well. Um, yeah. I'm just going to cut that down to size. Instead of using peel offs, I'm going to use card. Only because I can't see where. Oh, they're right in front of me. Um, right. So, oh. And it cut this bit down as well. So I'm going to cut this bit down to five and three quarters as well, just like that. And then I'm going to come in with my dobber and my vintage photo. And I'm just going to go around the edges. Now I'm only going to go around three of the edges because I'm going to put a peel off on um, the across like where the two papers meet so just like that um i'm going to grab my glue so let me take the lid off there we go and i'm going to glue this down okay so make sure i go it the right way and that's just going to go up Make sure I've got even amount of space on both sides. And then we're going to do the same thing to this one. I don't think I needed to put any ink on my dobber. I think there's enough on. But okay. So again, I'm just going to do, do that. Like I say, a really quick, easy card today. I didn't want to do too, anything sort of you know quite complex just wanted to make a nice um a nice quick one right and then just on the two long edges of this cardstock i'm just going to pop some vintage photo as well because i do want to use some peel offs okay so let's glue that down like so and then we're going to stick this on like that so the reason why i put that piece of cardstock on the bottom and the top is so that we fill the full card and then let's have a look i'm thinking i'm going to go with brown not colour I tend to go for, but yeah, let's go with the brown P 
peel off you can just use card for this so if you um so you don't have to use peel offs but i have them and yeah i really like them so i'm just gonna pop that on there like so and then get my scissors and then i'm just going to trim that and then we'll save that a bit because it can be used another day and then do exactly the same for the top okay so just like so right so that's our paper on our card and i think it's looking gorgeous do you know what i'm gonna go around uh, the card base as well with the vintage photo so let's do that I just think it adds just that little extra something okay and then just down this side right okay so that's that done and then keeping my ink i'm just going to come in with the vintage photo around the edge of my dress because i don't want it to be um that white to be really noticeable i want it just to blend in just a little bit more so just by adding a little bit of ink in so hopefully we'll do what we need it to do okay so then i'm going to stick my dress on and then before i stick it down i'm going to find some words so i'm going to use i'm using the inspirational words um but they have a bit of everything in. um so i think i'm going to have um i'm going to have shine hope and smile i think oh i want dream as well right i'm gonna have dream so hope dream and oh and sparkle yeah i like those ones so again i'm not going to put any extra income we're just going to go around the edge of these like so because I am keeping this a card as super super simple okay and I don't want that um, vintage photo to be super super like dark okay well just like that right and then I'm going to grab some dimension. And as a dimension, I mean cardboard. Um, and we're going to raise our dress up. So it's giving um, extra, the uh, card just a little extra something. But it's, um, it's, keep, it's also keeping it quite simple. So let's stick this bit down okay and then just making sure i've got good coverage on my piece go just in there just to make sure that there's not going to be any areas sagging on our piece okay so now i've done that i'm going to stick her in the center okay like so and I, I want one on her dress oh yeah i like that right so i'm gonna have hope just where her hand is and then we're gonna have sparkle and that's gonna sit on her dress and then i'm gonna have dream as well 
just there now the last thing to finish it off i think we could do with some gems so let's have a look see what gems i have um just, right i think i'm gonna go with some pearls some ivory coloured pearls so these come in the kit the pearls okay but I know that most of us have stuff like this in our stash and then I'm just going to add some on so three up in this corner I'm just using using an embellishment wand for this and then I'm going to do two down in this corner oh that one's joined together okay so one there and one there and that's as simple as our card is going to be how beautiful is that so really quick really simple um like i said i want to do too, anything too complex with it um but yeah i hope you guys like it uh so thank you so much for watching uh, everything that i have used um you can be found on my online store um but if you haven't got these you don't have to don't you know you don't have to use them Find, see what's in your stash and use what you have in your stash i'm hoping that you know i can just give you guys a little bit of inspiration on doing quick simple cards with very little product so yeah anyway thank you for watching let me know what you think um i love reading your comments i do try and answer all of them um but yeah i will see you guys in another video very soon uh but until then please all stay safe and happy crafting bye